Okay. <laughs> um, so I'm going to teach you really quickly how to decant wine. So what we have here, your couple little ingredients or ideas. You've got a decanter and you need a um, candle. Um, there's a couple different reasons why you decant wine. One is because of sediment. Uh, the other one is if you just want it to kind of open up a little bit quicker. Um, can kind of agitate the wine and just introduce it to air a little bit faster. Um, so that really essentially very, is very easy. All you would do is open the wine and just dump it into the decanter. Now, if you're going to do it for sediment, what you want to do is you want to light your candle. You probably want to do it kind of in a space that's a little bit further away from the wine. You don't really want the sulfur from the match to kind of mess with the wine. Um, and then open your wine, of course, because that's the most important thing. We all want the booze, right? You realistically, it would probably be best if you had something very old um, to put it in a basket. They have little bitty decaying baskets that you would use so the wine constantly stays this way um, and then the sediments will catch kind of right here. All right, and then what you're gonna do is you're actually going to just start pouring. You put the bottle of the wine, kind of the big fat part, um, over the candle and then just pour it into the decanter. What you're looking for is you're looking actually for sediment. You can actually see through uh, the wine because of the light of the candle. You can also use a flashlight too. Just make sure it's got a bottom, like a flat bottom. Um, and then what you're trying to do is you're just trying to make sure that the sediment in the actual wine stays in the bottle as opposed to going into your decanter. It's kind of like if you've ever been hiking, you know, you've got like maybe some dirt in your water. It's that same kind of concept. All right, there you go, and then you're ready to drink.